Hello folks, Don Rowley of the Colorado Springs Bougie Con Dojo, here to help expose yet another lie by noted fraud and incompetent martial artist Frank Dukes. Now this is best done in a written form. So this Friday I will put together a blog with direct quotes and links and things like that that are best done in the written format. I try to do a blog every Tuesday and Friday, so think of this as like a little uh, advertisement, a little uh, something to, to whet your appetite for what's coming up on Friday. Let me do some background on the subject. Frank Dukes has claimed that he learned ninjutsu from a guy named Senzo Tanaka. The Japanese way of saying the name would be Tanaka Senzo. I'll use both intermediately, uh, interchangeably. Now, Senzo Tanaka was also a character in Ian Fleming's James Bond novel, You Only Live Twice. Occam's Razor basically says that it's obvious that Dukes ripped off the name from the novel and tried to pull it off himself. There is no proof whatsoever at all that Dukes learned from anyone named Senzo Tanaka. There's no proof he learned ninjutsu. There's no proof he learned anything from a guy named Senzo Tanaka. There's no proof he was even in the same room with someone named Senzo Tanaka. Tanaka is, if not the most common name, one of the most common names in Japanese. So there's a few hundreds of thousands of people named Tanaka out there. If you have to be named Senzo even today, it's kind of an older style word, uh, name. Kind of like Eugene now. Anyways, so Dukes has been trying to say that, you know, rather than he ripped it off from the novel, that Ian Fleming knew or the real Senzo Tanaka and put in his novel, which would be a huge breach of security for anyone trained by a real intelligence agency like MI5, MI6, CIA, etc. But that's a story that Dukes has had to fall back on uh, after this exposure. Today he put out a piece he written him by himself in a rag, online rag, run by a friend seemingly, uh, and in this he had this to say with two important points. <clears throat> According to Ninjutsu authority, Reverend Dr. Christopher J. Basha, PhD, archives of the Imperial War Museum, Japan, and Richard Deacon, author of Kenpai Tai, there was a Senzo Tanaka who was an Ninjutsu expert who came from Japan, lived in Manchuria and China for a time, and became a Kenpai Tai agent operating in 1930s England. Okay, two things. First of all, I hear, have here in my hands the book Kenpai Tai by Richard Deacon. There is no mention at all of someone named Senzo Tanaka. There's like two or three people named Tanaka in the book, but there's no person named Senzo Tanaka that, and nobody that matches his description. So, obviously, Richard Deacon did not say that. Not in this book. It is a lie. Second, Imperial War Museum, Japan. Okay, do a web search of that. Imperial War Museum, Japan. There is no Imperial War Museum in Japan. There is an Imperial War Museum in England. And you will find among the top hits, uh, Japanese exhibits in the Imperial War Museum in England. You will find, of course, Imperial War Museum, Japan, in certain articles, but you will not find an Imperial War Museum in Japan. As a matter of fact, the Japanese word for imperial is teikoku. And while you used to find a lot of words like teikoku daingaku, Imperial University, since 1945 the entire that word has been kind of taboo. There's no Imperial University anymore. There's no Imperial Library. There's no Imperial War Museum. There is nothing called the Imperial War Museum in Japan. Even if there was, even if he's talking about something else and made a mistake, because they're not too bright, I want to see the records. I looked this guy up, Basha, and if he's an expert in ninjutsu, then I'm an expert in women's fashion, because I see women in dresses every day. And no Japanese ability. Just decided to read a few books, it seems, by Stephen Hayes and Ashita Kim and make his own ninjutsu style. That makes him an expert, then geez. Uh, then the local drunk is an expert on vintage wine. 
again, there's no proof. All the stuff about this, this is just yet more lies by Frank Dukes exposed. There will be more on Friday. So, I know it's two days away, but yeah, I, I have a schedule and I keep to it. So this Friday we'll put out a blog with direct quotes, links, etc. So until then, you know, just wait, even though I can practically see you in, uh, shiver in anticipation. But this Friday, there'll be more. Wait to see you then.